gorgeous shot. The sunshine is back, but we have more storms <laughs> in the forecast for this afternoon. But. Katie's hanging with us this morning. How's the day look? Should we get used to this or no? It's going to be a very similar weather pattern to what we saw yesterday. More sunshine through the morning, but yes, again, just one of those weeks where you want to pack the umbrella in the car just in case or the rain jacket because each and every afternoon we have the chance for seeing scattered showers and isolated thunderstorms. Downtown, though, it's a really nice start to our morning. In and around the metro, we're in the upper 50s, low 60s, plenty of sunshine to spare, but different story off across the eastern plains, mostly cloudy down to the southeast near Campo. Now our radar and satellite, as you can see, we've cleared out overnight. We're under a mostly sunny sky across much of the western half of the state, but once again this afternoon we'll continue to track the chance for scattered showers and storms. By 930, even into portions of Greeley, we are expecting some more rain activity. Clouds will increase through the morning hours, some peaks of sunshine through midday, and then once again, across the foothills, we'll start to see isolated storms moving off into the Denver area area mainly between about four and seven o'clock the best chance for seeing a few of those thunderstorms heaviest rain and the potential for some more flash flood warnings and watches mainly into our higher elevations and the Palmer divide. It's going to be a really similar weather pattern over the next couple of days. So Jason just be prepared. We're in stormy season so we have that chance of storms through the weekend and with that stormy season we could obviously some rock slides and actually some rocks that might still be on the road here this morning on some of the foothill roads and just be mindful of that right.